Hey guys, it's Brie. Welcome back to my channel. I don't know if I can necessarily say that since I've only made one video, but I'm back and I want to talk more about entertainment news. There's been a lot of just, I don't even know how to explain it, crazy cool things happening in, in the entertainment world lately. So I decided to come on here and make a little video for you guys. I like to first start off with talking about Justin Bieber and Hailey Bieber. And I know it's weird. Haley Baldwin, she once was, about only a year ago, which brings me to the point that it's Justin Bieber and Haley Bieber's one year of marriage anniversary. So let's give them a little bit of a round of applause. Woo, we never thought that they'd make it. Well, I never did, but you know, here they are proving me wrong every day. I think that they are very cute together. I remember at first I was like, oh my gosh, Selena, what are you doing, Justin? Like, Selena, you guys are meant to be. Um, but then as, as he started to be with Haley longer, I was like, okay, they're kind of cute. They kind of give off that best friend vibe, do everything together. He writes those sappy posts. And I also really didn't think that Haley Baldwin then would establish herself as Hailey Bieber when she changed her Instagram profile to Hailey Bieber I was like okay like we get it you're married to Justin Bieber I'm still gonna call you Hailey Baldwin but now I find myself calling her Hailey Bieber and I think she kind of fits that name I don't know at first I was like no I don't like them together this is weird like they came out of nowhere but they really didn't come out of nowhere I was looking up I think on E! News I found like their history of them being together. They actually met back in like 2000 and... So I ended up looking it up. They met back in 2009. I knew it was around the early 2000s around there, um, but they were actually introduced by Haley Baldwin's dad. So Haley Baldwin at the time, I know she's Haley Bieber now, but Haley Baldwin at the time, her dad, Stephen Baldwin, they met at like a fan event. I'm gonna insert a picture right here. I mean, Haley looks very different. So that was the first pick. That was the first time that they met. And then throughout the years, like, I guess they kept on kind of reconnecting. And finally, I think it was in 2018. I remember this picture a lot because they posted it and I was like, wait, Haley Baldwin and Justin Bieber, like where did this come from? There's a picture of them in South Beach. They're apparently, you know, getting cozy by the pool. Um, yeah, I saw this picture and I was like, uh, what, where's Selena? This doesn't make any sense. What's going on? Really, Haley Bieber, then Baldwin's relationship with Justin Bieber and them getting married, wasn't it really too out of the blue? They kind of knew each other a lot before then. So, I mean, good to them. Happy one year. Speaking about relationships. Okay, so I'm not going to say that I kind of called it, but I called it, you know, back in my first YouTube video when I was talking about Tyler Cameron and Gigi Hadid, how obsessed I was with them and how great they look together. It's a month later and they're still together. So I'm not going to say that I was right, but I was a little bit right. It was just a week ago, I'd say that him and... Forgot her name. Hello. I mean, heck. They were in the Netherlands for Gigi's grandmother's funeral. You're flying him to the Netherlands to be with you when your grandma died. Okay, they are getting serious up in here and I am here for it. We're talking about relationships, but let's talk about my boyfriend. Okay, not my real boyfriend. The guy that I wish was my boyfriend. The weekend, you know, I'm just really emotional. He was at the Toronto International Film Festival. I think he looks uh amazing he kind of went i guess radio silent on instagram he deleted his instagram i haven't seen like any new pictures of him in a really really long time the fact that he just stepped out in this new look i'm like okay i see you and also where's the albums i can't keep on listening to my dear melancholy and keep on pretending that it's new every day because it's just really hard i need new weekend songs <laughs> I know this is just a me problem, but I'm just saying, Abel, where's the album? Give it to us. We need it. So he stepped out. He was looking fresh. He got a new like facial hair moment, new hair moment. We love that for him. I just think he's really looking great, looking really clean cut and just a new man. We have the pictures, but now we just need a new album. So please, just please, before 2019 is over, just make us weekend fans happy. So I think this whole episode is just about relationships at this point because the last thing that I'm going to mention is a video that shook the world a few days ago. It honestly made me drop my phone. Sean Mendes and Camilla Cabello, Cabello, 
Dude, I don't know how to say your name. I think it's Camille Caballo. Yeah, Camille Caballo. Mm -hmm. Sean P Mendez posted a video of them two kissing. You're thinking, aw, kissing, that's so cute. No. Like, I actually looked at it and I was like, like someone would actually post this? I was just honestly horrified when I saw it. I get the point they were trying to get across. Like they were trying to say, oh, we're getting made fun of for how we kiss and all this stuff. The paparazzi's making fun of us. Don't post something like, like this is just, just kind of reminded me of those kids in high school that would kiss in the hallway that you just really didn't want to see, but you couldn't look away because it was just such a mess. Yeah, that's what this video kind of represented, so. I don't know, if you guys have any opinions about any of the stuff that I posted, feel free to leave your comments below. We can discuss this.